Here at Nakira Goings, who had 24 points, six three-pointers made tonight. Uh, you seem to really enjoy shooting the ball here at Cincinnati State. As a, it has been good to you. Yeah, I mean, the gym, I mean, it's real comfortable to be in. Um, my shot just feels really good right now. Um, I'm confident in it. Um, I've been working out on it a lot um, over the summer and in the preseason. So now that, you know, the season started, I'm ready to show, like, that I'm ready to knock down shots. Well, it certainly shows. And, you know, we talked after the exhibition game and during the offseason just about kind of your renewed uh, attack mentality uh, this year. You really kind of wanted to come out and make a statement early. And that certainly was the case. But it seemed like you did a good job, too, of kind of picking your moments tonight. It wasn't just shoot, shoot, shoot. You know, you kind of went through those stretches where you're feeling it. And that, that, that selectivity seems to be something that's really benefited you as well. Yeah, I mean, um, it's always not about me. I'm always looking for my teammates. If I have an open shot, I'll take it. Um, but I'm always looking for better shots. I, I know we talk about the good shot and the great shot. So we're always looking for a better shot. And, um, you know, it's not about what I do. It's about the team. So I, I just look for um, good shots and good shots for my teammates. Well, we've seen uh, a lot of good shots and great shots uh, from this team tonight. And uh, with the depth of this team, it's easy to get those great shots when you have so many scoring threats out there. Yeah, I mean, um, Everybody's starting to score. Um, I think that, you know, the freshmen are starting to step up. They got some minutes today. And, you know, between Shanice, Imari, on, I mean, just the whole team, you know, everybody's scoring. Everybody has the capability of scoring. So to know that we have so many people that can put the ball in the hoop is, is good going into this season. Here with Donna Owens following the Bearcats win over Slippery Rock in the home opener of the season and uh, 15 points, five assists for you. It seemed like uh, you guys really just came out fired up tonight uh, for the home opener. Mm, definitely, um, especially coming off that road game. It was a tough loss. Uh, it was a close one. It, we just had a bad taste in our mouth, so we had to come back strong. You know, Coach talked after the game on Friday and said, you know, while you never want to suffer a loss, it was it can always be a learning experience, especially early in the season. And it seemed like you guys did kind of learn from that, uh, you know, leading by about 10, 12 points, kept the foot on the gas tonight and were able to pull away in the second half. Mm -hmm, definitely. Um, that loss, I think it was good for us. Um, it's better to see it early than later. So um, it was a teaching point, and we just had to, you know, learn from it. Tell us about the, the team right now this year. I mean, the depth uh, obviously has been well documented. You have so many scoring threats, but it seems like also this team really kind of in attack mode all the time this year, and it's really been fun to watch. Yes, definitely. Um, no settling. Our coach told us we don't want to shoot threes. We, we need to attack the basket and just play tough overall. Just play aggressive and don't give up. UC Women's Basketball wins its home opener, 85-62 over Slipper Rock. Joined now by head coach Jamel Elliott. And, you know, we talked after the game on Friday. As you said, you never want to suffer an early loss, but it can be a great teaching moment. And it seemed like this team learned a lot from that game on Friday night and cleaned up a lot of things, and it really showed in the final score. Well, I was help happy with our defensive effort. You know, obviously giving up 80-something points a game in our first game was something that we didn't necessarily anticipate or want. Um, so we spent – we only had a short week, right? So we spent a day and a half of solid defensive and understanding how important it is to be selfish on the defensive end. We picked up a little bit our full court pressure today. I thought that hurt them a little bit and it gave us some opportunity to score. But everything starts with our defense and setting the tone. I thought Shanice gave us some really good minutes on the defensive end, on the ball, getting us some steals, some deflections in the open court that led to some easy baskets. And then that makes the offense so much easier. You know, when you play in defense, you're getting out, you're running, you transitioning from defense to offense. It's a lot easier to watch. It's a lot easier to play. And the, and the, and the results were exactly exactly what we wanted today. Yeah, the depth of this team has been very impressive, and it seems like, you know, the, the unselfish play comes with that too, and the team always kind of looking for that that better shot out there and not settling for a shot, and that, that kind of, again, kind of continues everything with both the offense and the defense, but the depth really a, a big key for this team. Yeah, like you mentioned it, like one of the, the first thing I said in the locker room, we had 36 made free th uh, field goals today, and out of the 36 free th uh, field goals we made, 20 of them was assisted. So that just goes to show you how we're sharing the ball, we're making the next pass to, from a good shot to a great shot we're looking up the floor to create some transition opportunities and I'm really liking what I'm seeing from a wide vision standpoint putting pressure on the defense more so in the second half where we was able to get to the foul line a little more than the first half so second game of the season obviously we're going to always have some things to improve on but I feel good improving on some things that want to know uh, every game we play we're trying to go one and know and today we did that